This is the Mac version of PowerPoint 2011 for Lab 1. You're going to start by opening up PowerPoint and select any theme that you'd like to work with. Once you have selected a theme, if you'd like, you can also change colors to any of the options that are here. Once you've selected your colors, go ahead and select Choose. That will create your basic slide. You're going to have to have at least four slides, each with a different layout. You'll want to make sure that you're on your Home button, Insert New Slide, and the title slide should be there already. So the next slide you'll need is Title and Content, and then you'll need New Slide, Content with Caption, and New Slide to Content. This will show a lot of the changes that we're going to make to the master slide. Now some of the changes that we're going to make will appear in different places depending on the theme that you've selected. For the theme that I've selected, the date will appear at the top and many will appear at the bottom. We're going to change to the slide master view. So you're going to go to slideshow, I'm sorry, you're going to go to themes and edit master. Slide Master. We're going to center all of the titles in the Slide Master view. So you'll select the title. Return to the Home view and center your text. Then we're going to change the font to Comic Sans and you can just type that in. And the reason that I'm selecting that font is not because it's a good font to use unless you're doing something for kids or actually comic book related. It's just very easily recognizable and it should not be the default in any of the slideshow themes. It'll be really easy to tell if you've done that. Next thing we're going to do is select the bullets and we're going to change the bullet style by hitting the drop down arrow next to the bulleted list and changing it to the arrows. We're going to add our name to the center of the footer. It, depending on your slideshow, it may appear center, it may appear here. And you can type it here or you can go to the insert option and select header and footer. And this will allow you to insert both the date and time. And I want you to change to the format that includes the day and add a footer with your name in it. If slide number is checked, please uncheck it. Hit apply to all, and then you can go back to the slide master and choose close slide master view, and you'll see that changes have been made to each of the templates, and you're going to save your file name with your last name, so it would be Winchester PowerPoint Lab 1. And then you'll hand in your presentation. 